I'm going to make this video real quick about, and this is my reaction on Alex Caruso being traded from the Bulls to the Thunder for Josh Giddy. It's a player for player, and I watched uh, Kenny talk about it a little bit and how he's, well, he's obviously disappointed because he's a Bulls fan. Like, this isn't like a huge, wow, blockbuster trade like how it was last summer where, you know, Porzingis was coming to the Celtics, Marcus Smart was going to the Grizzlies. Chris Paul was coming to the Warriors, Poole was going to the Wizards. Like, I think those trades are bound to come. It's not like the Bulls just got magically better with Giggity. Giggity, giggity. And who knows, maybe he buds into a superstar or whatever. The one who won this trade and the team that's instantly going to get better, I think, is the Thunder. Like, Alex Caruso was a piece in that Lakers championship run in 2020. Whether we call it a fluke, Mickey Mouse ring, or whatever. The dude did ball out and the dude was really good. And then he was shipped off to Chicago, which... I say you could probably name about five or ten squads in the league right now where it's like if you're traded there, you're it's where your career goes to die. A couple years ago it was the Wizards and it was the Hornets. And realistically speaking, there's probably six or seven teams that can compete for a championship. And right now I don't think the Bulls are one of them. And But I think the Thunder, sneakily, maybe. I think there's probably one more, just one more piece one more piece that needs to be there and it's it's depth honestly it's depth and experience of guys who can get you past you know Luka and Kyrie and the Mavericks in the playoffs those kind of series this team is very young and I think the franchise with the brightest future as we look forward obviously the Thunder like a lot of people have talked about a lot of people have made a lot of videos of the GM there and how he's done a master class where they have first round picks till what like 35 and just how they've built it from the ground up and they were the one seed in the west this year i think this is crazy to say but it's one of those things where weirdly because when Binyama, you know he's not going to be a rookie anymore he's going to get better i have a feeling that pop is going to get maybe one more finals before he retires so it's like we're looking at a thunder versus spurs western conference final and like three years, four years down the line as teams get better, you know, as this young core grows up together, like how the old young core was for the Thunder where they went to the finals all those many, many moons ago before they were separated and won their separate, you know, MVPs and championships. But that that's my thought on that. Alex Caruso definitely could be a key piece in helping them get better, get over the hump. But he, he definitely, definitely won the trade there. So that's my thoughts on that. Catch you in the next one.